Hello, hello, how are you? That is my face, by the way. In case you were wondering, we'll put it on the side like that, maybe. That's the Python code for doing this uh, face mesh. It's using MediaPipe NumPy. I don't know why it's using NumPy 4. Should primarily be MediaPipe. And no, it's a bit heavy, too heavy, as far as I'm aware, to turn into a web application. Wish I could uh, do that. That would be nice but it would not run in the browser. For anything to be a web application, there's essentially a combination of uh, uh, stuff running in the front end and the back end on the server. This one is actually a bit too heavy. I know it because when I even using it myself, well, I'm using it through the, through the website. So the traffic goes uh, onto the internet. So I know it's a bit heavy because if I use it too much, uh, I start dropping frames in my live stream, which I don't want to do. You could probably kill my live stream by over using the website. I'm using the same uh, machine to host the website and do the live streams. Probably shouldn't give you any ideas of how to. Is converting EG into, well, sound first, which is kind of, yeah, no brainer. Um, there's a lot of other tools out there that do that. We want to convert into music using MIDI libraries to having some trouble. Uh, loading those and we don't know how to code so we're using ChatGPT for that we i do know what i want but the uh, question is uh, can anyone deliver so if you're keen to help you don't like ChatGPT, you think you can do better code please this is a not-for-profit project if you would like to contribute I'll take uh, take your code and try implementing it on the site turning it into a flask application otherwise just use um, GPT-4. It's proven to sometimes, well, actually most of the time, uh, generate a decent code. So in this case, we just have this description. It does mention this main JS somewhere. So we'll pop that one next. We use plot EG, converting EG to music. So this calls a back end which we have in our app i it's a back and has the convert eg to music function we only have this three files so about 300 to 400 lines of code chgpt4 is able to keep all that in the context which is great the problem is that it's not playing anything out we do have a file output midi does exist let's see if it's being regenerated i think it's only a generated once okay let's go one by one ensure that the convert eg to music route is being called correctly i don't think it's being called and check with f12 network so we restart this Page. We have all this stuff being loaded. Um, data image get EG data doesn't seem to be called. Okay, can you do this for us? Check the network browser. Well, it's not there in the main JS. Convert EG to music. Uh, search for convert EG for music as we have it once in the function. I think this function is actually not being called properly. Don't think it's wired. Wait, is it wired to any event? We do have the play MIDI. Should just play a tone. This doesn't work. It's not generating any errors as well, which is not cool. If you play MIDI as a button, it might want to turn it into click that's a great suggestion okay will it work now uh, okay now it's working can i hear anything should hear a tone for one second no it's actually no it wasn't working we had the a frequency generator working but not the tone generator why is it not just working out of the box 
Yep, that's the console output that appears in media functionality. Your code is working correctly in terms of sending media message, but the issue seems to be with the media output device. The console shows me through as available media output device. This is typically a virtual media board used for routing signals to the software application and doesn't produce sound on its own. Get the media files, you need MIDI synthesizer or a software application that can receive mis uh, media messages. Understand so JS initialization. Yeah, so one thing is for sure we do not have a physical media device and yeah, let's go with the first option and give me fake uh, links again i hope not can I get a specific guide not a general guide okay i need to check if this link is actually okay it has something on it okay so in the html where you have a bunch of stuff in there now in JavaScript. Do we have an audio context already? Where do we have con constant section in the piano? Lemon by D. Play MIDI. Don't need any of that, do I? I have to try. And let's comment that out for a sec. In the piano, piano. Put this work at all. It's a new thing. Okay, what's this error for this to be a global object we need to define it here somewhere browser should be compatible yes because it's problem with this bit as well hey okay, we're in business still loading yeah loading forever right takes uh, was it 1.5 uh, megabyte acoustic grand piano it's quite a bit but it works so should not be complaining should we okay so we are in business what we want to do now is play so this is just the note testing this player the midi file being stored somewhere but it's not actually loading now can we make sure the eg into music function is actually being used and we can um, play it while uh, any of the input values on the front panel are changing we have this one it's working i don't know if you can hear it it's too soft but that's okay it's better than too loud yeah we need to integrate the eg to music conversion we have the function make sure the functions work works okay but we need to make sure we actually integrating it properly and then instead of so this play a eg button should be renamed in to test piano do we need the midi file or can we just play straight in the browser okay so instead of converting into midi file converting a series of musical notes return the series of notes frequencies in J as a json response from convert EG to music route okay that sounds good we already doing this convert EG to music yeah saving file to change that then we have a play sequence function in JavaScript. Okay, that looks legit. But how do we change the Python code? EEG data is assumed to be a list of frequency like values. These values are scaled and mapped to musical notes using a linear interpolation. The list of corresponding musical notes is returned as a JSON response, which can be easily consumed by your front end JavaScript. Please adjust the EEG data processing part, EEG underscore frequencies, according to how your actual EEG data is structured. This function assumes a simple scaling, but your actual EEG data might require a more complex mapping to musical notes. Hey, GPT-4 is stuck. No, it's alive again. It's alive. Okay, let's see. Are we able to integrate these changes or not? Okay, function to handle sequence of notes. This function is called something else. Batch URL. It's fetching JSON. It's already doing that. Response OK, throw a new arrow. That work. Otherwise, response JSON. OK, this bit. And notes, play sequence. Create function to play the sequence in that slider. How many of this event listeners do we have? Three at the moment. Play mini. Don't have one for data slider. It's unusual can add one here just let's double check that we don't have this already in update that 
the a function for this existing code. We need all the existing code. They remove and use web midi js code and do it later. Let's reload this page. So this node is working okay. Let's check for errors. We have seven errors. Any suggestions how to fix this from ChatGPT? Once you confirm that the static response is working correctly, you can proceed to implement the actual EEG data processing logic. It's always the technical issues that we are having trouble with. Some sort of silly mistake in this code. We might start a new ChatGPT uh, chat, try and solve this one. Essentially, the problem is that the JSON file is not transferring the musical notes as it should. So I'll try debugging this later. So let me know if any questions, put your comments down below, anything meaningful, suggestions, uh, complaints, uh, future directions, whatever collaboration requests, anything like that. Uh, put them in the notes or find me on LinkedIn and I'll see you next time. Bye.